Hey, what's up guys? This is Prandel, and welcome to a new video. Well, more like a new type of video. Today I'm going to do things a little bit differently. Today's going to be more of a discussion video rather than, you know, a game let's play or anything like that. So today we're talking about, of course, Kingdom Hearts 3. Recently I've been seeing a lot of people talking on the internet about how there's a chance that we'll be getting less Final Fantasy characters in Kingdom Hearts 3 more along the lines of we won't be seeing them as much. I have a feeling that we're still going to see like some of the classics that we've had in the past in Kingdom Hearts, such as Cloud and Leon and Yuffie and all the others that we are used to seeing in the numbered Kingdom Hearts games like 1, 2, and now 3. One thing that I've been kind of curious about is whether or not they're going to include some of the newer Final Fantasy characters such as Noctis or his group. I think it would be interesting if they did include Noctis in Kingdom Hearts 3 because he's so relevant currently because of the obviously because of the new game because honestly I think he would really fit well in the universe. So we're just going to quickly talk about some, you know, pros and cons to actually including Noctis. One pro for me personally would be I think that Noctis and Sora their personalities would really mesh really well. I think they're both kind of hotheads and I think that that would be I think that would work really well as far as like a comedic standpoint. I think there, we could have some really funny dialogue between the two of them. A con would be the fact that Noctis and Riku literally look almost identical. Like you can tell, like Nomura had to have done this on purpose. I mean, it's so obvious. Hey, let's take Riku and completely change his appearance. What should we do? I'm glad you asked. What we're going to do is we're going to change his hairstyle completely. Let's make it more like that knocked dude on uh, the new Final Fantasy game. Let's just do it that way, okay? Like, we won't change the color. We'll just make it look just like his hair. Uh, are we changing his wardrobe? Abso-fucking-lutely we're changing his wardrobe. What should we do? Plaid. Just, just, just plaid. But, like, anything else? No, just, just plaid everywhere. All plaid. Plaid. Are you sure you don't want to add anything else? All right, fine. Buttons and zippers. Nora, are you? Have you lost your mind? Just hey, don't argue with me on this, okay? Just do it. Buttons, zippers, knocked his hair. We're done. What about his keyblade? Giant car key. Let's just fucking do it. All right, we're on it. But that would be that would be probably the main issue. Noctis and Riku could literally have no interaction whatsoever. It would have to be Sora on his own, just running into Noctis and all the other dudes. Just, that's it. Riku cannot be involved at all because they look too much alike. Be like throwing two twins together. It doesn't work. Another pro would be, honestly, the way that both Sora and Noctis' weapons kind of manifest themselves. Sora's Keyblade, he puts out his arm and it just appears in his hand in the shimmery light of light and shimmeriness. What? And Noctis, on the other hand, when he has the royal arms weapons, they kind of do a very similar thing. Yeah, it spins around him in their blue, but he still puts his arm out and it still manifests in his hand with a little bit of shimmer, just like Sora. So I think that that would be a really cool kind of way to relate, not really necessarily to relate the characters, but it would just be something that would it would relate them thematically, if that makes sense. I don't know, I think that would be pretty cool. Now, I've been trying to think on how the two characters could actually meet, because obviously they're in completely different worlds and different universes or galaxies, I don't know. But I think a good way for them to actually meet up with each other would probably be Radiant Gardens. Mainly because that seems to be where all the Final Fantasy characters that we already have kind of have... Be it's kind of become their, their hub world, you know? And I feel like Noctis and his group could probably show up there. Maybe they're looking for another royal arms weapon, or they could just be there to, I don't know, refuel the car. If the car can, I don't think the car can even do intergalactic travel. I don't know what that thing, that car can do now after they've added like the off-road mode with the giant monster truck wheels and all that craziness. Maybe the car can sprout wings now and it can fly through space. Who? fucking knows. But I think Radiant Gardens would be a good location for them to actually meet Sora. Maybe they can hunt a few Heartless together. Maybe Ignis can 
teach Sora how to cook a, a meal and then bring in Remy to fucking do the rest of the cooking while he's pulling on Sora's spike hair. I don't know. Another cool thing would be maybe they can do like sparring practice with each of the characters. Kind of like they did in Final Fantasy XV. You could have Sora fighting against Noctis. Then you could fight Gladio. Then you could fight Ignis and Prompto. And maybe each one is like a different level, strength level, kind of like in Final Fantasy. Who knows? Personally, I think it would be really cool if Noctis and the boys showed up in Kingdom Hearts 3. I don't think it would really take too much away from the main storyline. I think it would just be kind of like a fun little kind of, not necessarily an Easter egg, but just a little homage to Final Fantasy. Just include some more Final Fantasy characters. I think that'd be cool. I think it would add more than it would take away. A lot of people are thinking, oh no, that game's too new. It wouldn't work. I, I, don't, I disagree. Let me know what you guys think. I, just a fun little discussion. You know, let me know in the comments what, if you guys think it would be a good idea to add Noctis or maybe the whole group or just Noctis himself. Maybe just throw in one character or maybe a young Noctis like him as a little kid. Maybe there's some time you know difference going on or something. I don't know. I think it'd be cool. But anyway, guys, that's all the time I have for today. Just a fun little quick discussion. And I, I think I might do some more of these. I think it's a little fun idea. But yeah. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that kind of fun stuff. It helps me out a lot. And, you know, I'll see you in the next video. And as always, this is Prandle, and this is goodbye.